Say hi to people. Hey people. They're my, they're my people. Hey people. <laughs> this is Charlie. Charlito. <laughs> he has wanted nothing to do with this setup until we pressed record on the camera. And here he is, sitting behind our <laughs> little thing for you guys. Mm. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Robbie. I'm Robbie. <laughs> He's my fiance. <laughs> He's gonna be in some more videos, especially the ones involving Kangen. Today we're gonna talk to you a little bit about water bottles and this fancy K8 machine that we have in our house. Water bottles are terrible. We don't need them. You are wasting your money on them. You are contributing to the plastic crisis that's going on on our earth. Mm -hmm. And you don't know how long the water is sitting in these water bottles before it gets to you. That's true. The pH scale ranges from zero to 14. Your body needs to stay at a pH of 7.365. And pH is kind of like your temperature. It's really important to regulate it and keep it within that perfect state. Let's talk about alkalinity. <laughs> so this is really cool dude from the past. His name is Dr. Wahlberg. Uh, in 1931, he won the Nobel Prize for his cancer and other disease research. And he discovered uh, through various tests with alkalinity that cancers and other diseases cannot survive in an alkaline rich environment. So what is alkaline? Alkaline is basically your fruits, your vegetables, your nuts, your seeds, raw juices, basically anything of that sort. Then what's acidic? Anything and everything that isn't alkaline is acidic. So everything else, we're talking about meats, we're talking about cheeses, we're talking about proteins, wheats, eggs, we're talking about sodas, bottled water, we're talking about even the air we breathe is acidic. What do we have today? We have an assortment of bottled beverages that on a day-to-day -day basis, we normally don't touch. But for the purposes of this video and for this demonstration, we wanted to show you with our pH drops what the pH levels of each of these drinks generally range around. That's right. Sasani, Deer Park, Life Water, Smart Water, Fiji, Evian, Pangan Water. Now, my question to you, Al, is if you pre-twisted any of these before you put them up here. I did not. All right. You wanna yeah. zoom in? Let's show the people they are sealed right there. All right, let's go for it. Let's start pouring. I'm gonna add about three drops of our pH. He has water, guys. Mm. He has water. And it's 8.5 Kangen water because he only drinks the best. So I have pH drops here. I'm gonna add about three to each of these glasses full of water and we're gonna see what happens. We're just gonna give these a little stir here. We have bottled water, bottled soda that is on the low end of the pH scale. We have Sprite. Dasani, Deer Park, Life Water, Smart Water, Fiji, Evian, and our very own Kangen Water. As you guys can see, we have a wide range of soda, bottled water, different kinds of bottled water that all show up all over the pH scale. We have our yellows, our reds that are very acidic versus our blues and our purples that are very alkaline. Acidity causes disease, alkalinity promotes health. You may be saying, but I drink this bottled alkaline water at home. Well, Alex, I drink this bottled alkaline water at home. Am I safe? No, you're not safe. The world is ending. So if you drink this bottled alkaline water at home, stay tuned. We have a video coming very, very soon about what the difference is between this bottled alkaline water and this Kangen water. So how do you know if your body is acidic? So basically, if you're always sick or tired, your body is in an acidic state. We want our bodies to be alkaline. At all points in time, we want to be doing whatever we can to get the nutrients that we need, the oxidation 
Um, we want to reduce oxidation. Um, we want our bodies to thrive in an alkaline environment. And the best way to do that is to consume either alkaline foods or alkaline beverages. So say you're consuming a mostly plant-based diet. This is great. You're probably doing everything that you can to help your body thrive in this alkaline state, but it is still not enough. As alkaline as plants are, you can't get enough nutrients from plants on a daily basis to keep your body at an alkaline pH. You need the help of some sort of additive. Say that you're mostly drinking Evian, Fiji, Smart Water, Life Water, the ones that you can see that are better. So say mm -hmm. you take a sip of Kangen Water. Just like that, your body's more alkaline. Just like that. One sip. One sip. One sip. Now, see what happens when we're getting to the most acidic. So say you're drinking Dasani. You thought it was healthy. Still, one sip of Kangen water. All right. Take a look at what happens when we get to the most acidic. Four soda. More Kangen water? More Kangen water, guys. We can pour all day. That's not going to change colors. So say you're feeling pretty good. You're drinking your water. And you decide to have a sip of soda. We've already watered this down. One sip, sip of, of soda. soda. Sip of 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 soda. That one sip of soda has changed the acidity of all of our different waters. Including our kangen water. Including our kangen water. Soda is actually so acidic that it would take four gallons of kangen water to alkalize one bottle of Sprite. Guys, this is the exact stuff you don't want in your body. This is what's making you sick. This is what's making you tired. This is what's making you feel sluggish. And I know, I was the same way. I wasn't always on this kick. Before, I would have maybe a sip of soda, maybe one soda each week, right? But we're talking about one sip changing the entire pH level of all of these different cups of water. So think about one bottle a day, or think about some of you that need your caffeine or feel like they need that sugar. That's actually not doing your body any good. It's throwing your internal working out of balance. And then diet soda and dark colored soda are even more acidic than Sprite. Our acidic environment. See, guys, these have become so acidic now. With one sip of soda. With one sip of soda. That we can't pour enough alkaline water to change the pH. You see it changing back? That's one sip of soda in each of these waters. So clearly, drinking this bottled water is better than drinking soda, but you are still contributing to all of the plastic waste. I can drink probably four or five of these a, a day. So how many plastic water bottles am I wasting in an entire year if I'm drinking five of these a day? And on top of that, this is bottled. This is natural straight from the tap. In an ideal situation, you can just take this straight from the tap, straight from your K8 or Kangen machine, and you're getting fresh water every time. Deer Park is bottled in Pennsylvania. So that means it really doesn't have that far to travel to get to us here in Maryland. Even still, it can sit on the shelves anywhere from three to six months before it reaches here. And it doesn't expire until October of 21. So this means this bottled water is still good for over a year. Let's talk about Fiji. Fiji might be great if we're in Fiji, but how long, if this can take anywhere from three to six months, this can take anywhere from one to two years before it gets to us. Do you want to be drinking water that's one or two years old? No. No, you don't. <laughs> this water, maybe about a year old. This water, five minutes old. 
<laughs> Come on, which one do you want? Guys, I hope that this has been an eye-opening experiment. Um, I know I personally, with the first time I saw this, like my mind was blown just to see what one sip of soda can do in terms of your internal pH level and what one sip of Kangen water can do if you're already drinking If you're water. already drinking it. Yep. And so just so you guys know, I know we turned the colors back, so we're just gonna do this one more time. So what are you guys drinking? Guys, it is very, very clear. Acidity leads to oxidation. Oxidation leads to aging. It leads to disease. It leads to all the bad things that you don't want in your body. In order to keep your natural pH level nice, calm, and alkaline, you really gotta be taking in a lot of alkaline material. You can start to make these changes in your life by taking one step to choose Kangen water and alkaline water. So guys, just remember what one sip, when you start drinking Kangen water, what it'll do to your body if you're already pretty healthy. Once again, guys, close up, come on. One sip of Kangen water can start to promote health and healing versus something like this, which is just going to promote and encourage disease and cancer and all of that to happen in your body. We want to stay healthy, guys, especially with everything going around nowadays with this COVID crisis. We want to put things into our body that will have us here for a longer time. So we want to be here for our families. We want to be here for uh, our loved ones. So uh, it's really best to start thinking about the things that we put into our bodies on a day to day basis. Kangen water is one of those things that you can put in and you can see the effects positive for your body, the positive effects immediately. So if you guys would like to get one of these Kangen machines into your house, just let me know. I will link some links below. You can read some more about it on my website. You can contact me on Instagram or through my website, through email. I would love to hear from you. I would love to get one of these machines into your house so you can change your water and change your life. You and your family, all right? This isn't just about you as an individual. This is about changing the world, getting these harmful toxic bottles out of here and start providing wonderful solutions for healthy living for you and everybody you care about. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been really, really fun. Let us know if you have any questions and we'll see you soon with our bottled alkaline water. Don't forget to like this video, leave me a comment down below, and subscribe to this channel. Love you guys. In your life, in your family's lives. Are you, are you promoting things? Yeah, promoting everything. But like your... Do you know how YouTube works? No, I'm just pointing. <laughs> Count it down, Al. Huh? What are you guys drinking? Charlie. Hi. Hi. Hey, what's that? Look, say hi to the camera. Say hi. Charlie, you're on camera. See? <laughs> <laughs> back, um, back to back. <laughs> Charlie wants to play fetch. Can you guys see? Charlie, we're filming a video. You okay. Threw it. I know. Right. You think that was good? Mm -hmm. He's gonna be here a little more often now, right? I mean, I've always been here. Yeah, but you don't record him with me. Yeah, but like I'm in the other room. So all the time, trying to get this started, trying to get everything organized. This, Just is, not ready. this is what YouTube is. Your turn. It's my turn now. <laughs> That's what we want. We want the alkaline. Hey guys. Oh, I forgot to look at the camera. I'm looking at me. So what is alkaline? I don't think I was looking at the camera. What do we have today? I was looking at it. What do we have today? <laughs> I know, right? We have an assortment. <laughs> the pH scale. Oh, I'm not even looking at the camera. No, but I'm going to put it up here. Okay. It's here? It's here? Yeah, it's here? figure out where you want to. I don't know. The pH scale ranges from 0 to 14. We have an assortment of disgusting death. Excuse and... me, this one's our good stuff. Okay. Yeah. 
for Robbie. So as you guys can see here, <laughs> this you asked is why, me, you asked me this is why I don't record with you. You asked, you asked record me. Record while you're not. You asked me to get fired. Okay. This. Yes. This is gonna be an entire video of us fighting. I yes, it is. So continue. Go ahead. 